What's up? Welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to show you how to build a shooting floor on a 2x2, 2x1, or circle base design. Starting with the 2x2, you're going to add triangles to each corner of the honeycomb, like so. I'm giving you the half triangle peak or door peaks. Wrap it up with windows. Kind of. I'm going to add door frames, and they need to be on the right side of the, not that far right, on the right side of each peak, like so. And then you can put your door frame or your door in your door frames to open out into the open uh, area. You want them to open into your gaps. That's the point of putting your door frame on the right side. And that makes it not impossible, but hard for somebody to be able to go in and out through the peaks there. Now we can take, fill in our triangles. squares and we can put some embrasures if we like I prefer the vertical embrasures so you can see up and see down and uh, that's the 2 by 2 and step 2 I'm going to show you how to do a shooting floor just like we did in step one, but on a two by one honeycombed. On this base, it's a very similar design. We want to fill in the honeycomb, if not done already. Then you're just going to add two triangles to each corner, just like on the two by two. And this gives us the exact same peak we're looking for. We will wrap it in the windows. And door frames on the right side of our gaps. And doors that open in. Or open out, excuse me. They open out into the gap. We're gonna fill the roof in, just like we did in step one. And we'll throw a couple of razors on the front of it. We would do this all the way around typically, but for the video, we're only doing one side. This is our 2x2 two two or 2x1. Two and now we'll move on to step 3. In step 3 of this video, I'm going to show you how to add a shooting floor to a, a round triangle base. First, you want to add a square floor frame or floor tile to every other triangle. In between those, we're going to add three more triangles, just like so, giving us the desired peak down we're looking for. We will wrap this in windows like we did with the other ones. door frame on the right side of the peaks the door opening in to the gap
now you have to add door frames to each side that has the triangles this is stability for roof otherwise you won't be able to place all your roof tiles typically you're going to want to add more but that's the minimum you need to be able to place your roof tiles like so you could just spam this with doors or you can add some walls in between or shop fronts the whole design is up to you and there it is add a couple of embrasures And there you have it, your circle-based shooting floor.